today is ready to wear Wednesday and I have a dancing type of apparel, I would say. You'll see why once I take off. It's a little small blazer that I have on, okay? All right, so <laughs> yes, this is more like a party type of look. Um, I feel very confident in it, honestly. I really, really like it. So let's start out with what I have on. So this little blazer here that I have on, it has one button in the front. It is a plaid type of blazer and some of you will probably say why did you pair this with this outfit because once you see it all you're gonna go what sometimes it's good to mix patterns mix patterns is very cool okay it's very cool and it's trending and it's popular so sometimes we can mix it all up sometimes and actually create something very pretty. Um, I like this look um, and I love this blazer. This blazer is from Shein. Okay, I got it some time back. Don't remember, but I have everything listed in the description box. Okay, and then this skirt that is asymmetrical. Okay, as you can see. <laughs> Very asymmetrical, and um, I love everything about this asymmetrical because it's just a piece of fabric that's hanging there on the side. And then you got the mini skirts. I love it. This is from Fashion Nova. This skirt, and then underneath it here is something I've had for years. Okay, it's this okay i do have some padding underneath there just saying these days i do tend to wear a lot of you know like shapewear padding and everything because some of my um clothing i think i need that okay uh so this of course you see what it is and I think this together looks like a complete dress. It looks like a dress, but it is two pieces, okay? It's two pieces, but I just added that on, and so it looks like a dress. I really, really like the pattern. Now, this is more like a lace. As you can see, it's a lace material. It really gets just kind of boost me up here on the top <laughs> and it also kind of like gives me the shapewear effect okay so it's like shapewear okay it is but you can wear this this is sort of starting to be a trend or been a trend for a while and I thought with this outfit I thought I would uh, pair this together and wear it because I feel like it looks like a dress. Now, I did pair this outfit with these same shoes I had on in my previous video, which is Taylor Tuesday. So today is ready to wear Wednesday, and I'm ready to wear some of these sexy pieces, okay? I just absolutely am ready. I'm ready for healthy me and I'm ready for some beautiful, sexy pieces. And so I just feel like this is really nice if you're going dancing. If you're going out dancing or you're staying in and you're dancing, I think this is very, very nice and cute. I put my hair up and all as if I was going to dance. So it wouldn't get hot or whatnot. But I do love <laughs> what I have on this asymmetrical. Like, look at this from the side. It is just so cute from the back. This skirt is the first time I've put it on since I got it. So this is nice. I love it. It's comfortable. It gives me like that sexiness type of vibe and sometimes we need that every once in a while so this is what it looks like buttoned up once again
in fabrics, different kind of fabrics is in. Doesn't always have to be super duper matchy. Um, but it, but this does match because this uh, this uh, plaid does have black in it, and it goes really well with the skirt. However, most people would would have went with a white blazer or a black blazer or any other color blazer, just a plain blazer type of top or whatnot. And then some would have went without one, okay? But I thought I would show it in case, you know, you, you were going out or going out somewhere and you just needed something to put on top of your shapewear top, okay? You're wearing a shapewear top as a top. Well, shapewear as a top. And hey, there's nothing wrong. I actually put what I need to put in this area to cover up everything. And I just think it looks really, really cute and really, really lifting and supportive. And I just think it looks good. And I love the legs because I can't wait for spring and summer, okay? Because that's the time when most people are having like dancing parties or, um, or just having dance with, you know, whoever in your home, whatnot, and you just want to dress up a little bit, like, what's wrong with that? Nothing, okay, if it's okay with you at this time and day, but, you know, um, I just think it's okay to get a little sexy from time to time. I'm really into, like, more mature pieces. As you probably can tell, my style has changed. I've basically been putting on a lot of things that really do kind of what most of you think. Or most people would say, okay, that is ideal for her age being 48. But you know what? Sometimes I'm going to amp it up because I know. I don't look like I'm 48. Thank you. <laughs> Sometimes. And even though I am 48, I still like to be sexy from time to time. Doesn't mean just because you're 40, in your 40s that you can't, like, you know, amp it up, you know, be a little sexy every now and then. Nothing's wrong with that. So that's what this is all about confidence. My legs, confidence, short skirts, okay, um, and then also the shape where it's top, like this is confidence in your 40s, okay, confident in your 40s, um, the skirt doesn't have to be as short as mine, okay, but this is the way the skirt came, I do like that the asymmetrical kind of give it a little bit more length there, um, but you know what? It's not too short for me, in my opinion, to wear if I was going to a party or a dance party or something like that. This is okay because I could add on a pair of shape or shorts underneath that and so I would be fine, okay? But anyways, you guys, this is the look for ready to wear Wednesday because I'm ready to wear some sexy pieces. I'm ready to reveal my confident self that I am. And you know, you know, in a modest way, but very confident and love myself. And you know, every once in a while I wear something very attractive sometimes. Everything is attractive, I mean, to each in everybody's own opinion, um, whether you're completely concealed from head to toe, that's attractive too. But sometimes I like to wear something like this. This is just my opinion, and sometimes I, I I'm gonna do this from time to time. Okay, so yeah, you guys, y'all know how it goes over here. This girl like some attractive outfits and y'all know this.
So even though I'm in a new type of vibe of fashion, which is more what you guys feel that is more appropriate for my age, I'm still going to rock what I do like from time to time. And this is something maybe this length, like this skirt, something a little bit more, you know, what we call, you know, a little sexy or whatnot. Um, and sexiness can be a long, elegant dress. It could be whatever you feel like that's attractive or whatnot. But, you know, sometimes I just like to do something like what I have on right now. So y'all, now it's time for me to strut on my runway and I want to say thank you to everyone that's watching. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. And also, I want to say much love, care, kindness, peace, joy, and happiness to everyone. And yeah, I will see y'all in my next video tomorrow, which will be Thirsty Trends. So stay tuned. And yeah, you guys, it's time for me to strut on my runway. So let's get started. <laughs> Can't say you love me when it's like that. Can't say you love me when it's 